At 17 Nanumet Street in Onset, sits an 11-year-old Emma Kendrigan with a bucket of homemade dog treats. For just a dollar per treat, Emma raises money to help support a local endeavor to feed the homeless in Wareham. Her generosity came from a long-standing tradition with her grandmother. We save up quarters throughout the whole school. We, uh, it's not only quarters. We save change throughout the whole school year. Mm. And then we bring it to the bank at the end of the year and we cash it all in and get the cash and get a toy. Mostly a toy because that's what I usually get. I got my scooter over there actually. Very cool. <laughs> but this year you decided to do something different. This summer Emma decided to donate her change to feed the homeless. She was inspired by Z Suarez of Seven Hills who pick up food donations around the community to feed the homeless. So it was purely her idea? It was her idea. It was her idea. And we, um, Z had told me um, that ham and bologna were the favorites, so we went to the store and we, it was a little late. Um, Z comes at 11.30 and it was probably 11 o'clock we were at the store and we came home and we had an assembly line making bologna and cheese sandwich with a banana and a, a snack chips mm. or something and bagged them all up and we got there on time right yes <laughs> how did it feel to do something for somebody else it felt nice it was just like really nice to do it because it makes people happy emma's efforts haven't gone unnoticed yep someone just donated in the rain <laughs> Wow. <laughs> oh, they have been so generous. We, Emma's made over $500 collecting. And then Emma's cousin Maddie, he told her what? If I raised $100 in the day that I was out there, that he would match it and give us another 100 Wow. I raised $200 that day. We still only got 100 but not only 100 but like <laughs> we still got $100, but he raised 200 that day. Very it good. It really pushed us to do more, so. Yeah. And rain as my witness, Emma delivered this message. It, what I want people to know is, like, if you were homeless, like, you would want people helping you, too. You wouldn't want people just saying, like, oh, we're not going to do this. Like, you would really want people helping you.